Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Lizzie, and today, if you guys have some mechanophobia, I recommend clicking off of this video because we are gonna be looking at the scariest, most cursed, rapiest underwater animatronics. You guys loved the last video we did watching really weird abandoned animatronics, and they were like, you know, Chuck E. Cheese looking ones and underwater ones, but today we're diving deep. Haha, <laughs> get it? Because we're looking at underwater animatronics. Ha, <laughs> I'm so funny. Anyways, we're diving deep into the internet to find the most cursed underwater animatronics. So if you guys are excited, be sure to smash a like or else the scary animatronic will pop up in your bedroom at night. Make sure to hit the subscribe button to join the family today if you guys are excited for today's video because we are also getting super close to 3 million subscribers. And uh, without further ado, let's get right on into this video. The scariest underwater animatronics. It's this guy again from the last video. These better be spooky, okay? I'm ready to see some scary animatronics. All right, let's take a Look, what do they got this time? Billabong Bunyip. That sounds familiar. Whoa! Okay, that looks cursed. Why does its teeth look like that? Why does it look kind of like realistic too? Okay, it looks like a water dragon. Jaws! I talked about this one in the last video. I kind of like Jaws though. I don't find him that scary. Oh, he's kind of cute. I think it's cute, okay? I like Jaws. Wait, that was Jaws at the very end. Let me go back there. Why does he look so different in this scene right here, okay? He looks decayed and old and yeah, okay, that is a little spooky. The scariest underwater animatronics. What does this guy think is the scariest ones? Loch Ness Monster. Loch Ness Monster seems pretty cute. Wait, is that it right there? Behind the boat? That's an animatronic? Did they use that for like the film or something? King Kong. Is that a ride? I wonder where that ride is. That's cool looking. Whoa! That animatronic is huge! Okay, why is that one actually really cool? I like how his eyes like change colors. It's like cool but like kind of freaky at the same time. I don't know. I kind of vibe with that. What is this one? Oh, I think this is another like Jaws like kind of thing or shark. A shark animatronic. I don't know if it's specifically Jaws. Maybe it is. I think it is because they used, like I said, an animatronic to film Jaws. That looks creepy. Yeah, they used, you know, animatronics to film the movie Jaws. And um, now that I'm looking at it, they look a little bit too realistic to, um, you know, whoa. Whoa, that looks so real. Yeah, they literally look like a real shark. Okay, that would freak me out. If I saw that in the ocean, I would freak out. That literally looks like a real shark, okay? That is spooky. Underwater animatronics and statues before and after. Some mechanophobia warning, all right. Whoa, that one is pretty sick though. It's kind of creepy though. Oh, okay, okay, that is creepy. It looks like some kind of underwater dragon. I wonder where that is at. Hippopotamus, is that from Jungle Cruise? Pretty sure it is. Oh, okay, that's creepy. It looks so cursed right there. I don't like seeing it without the water and I didn't realize it's like half a body like that it's just kind of like floating there i would have never known because on the jungle crew was like they just have them like pop out you know off the top of the edge of the water <laughs> the scariest underwater animatronics it's this guy again with the scary eyes crocodile in the woods oh i've seen this one. Oh, i don't like that i don't like that keep him in the cage where he belongs what's even weirder is i think this one or another one like it's like kind of like you pay for it to pop out it's at some weird theme park Loch Ness monster is that the same one from the other movie it looks so realistic it looks so real. Like, if I saw that, I would truly believe it was the real Loch Ness Monster, okay? Like, it looks like a real one, okay? Oh, what the heck is that? <laughs> it looks kind of derpy, to be honest. It kind of looks like, I don't want to, like, be mean to my dog, but it kind of looks like my dog when she sees, like, a piece of cheese. She gets like that. Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the f <laughs> The scariest underwater animatronics. I love how everyone's like pointing up to the text like this. They're like the scariest, but also me. Monster the whale. This is at Disneyland, okay? I haven't even been on this ride, I don't think. Or maybe I did when I was like five. It's a little kid's ride. It can't be that scary. I've never been on this one in like years. Monster the whale. It's such an old ride. Wait, what? Is that the eye from the whale or is this a different ride? Is that the real like eye from that ride? It is. That's creepy. Okay, I actually don't like this giant eyeball. I think that's the same ride, y'all. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that's actually a little bit horrifying, okay? Oh my goodness, it's this guy. He just owns this category of TikTok, y'all. Abandoned animatronics. Joko's Mardi Gras madness? That's cre- Oh my gosh, the after is horrifying! Why does he look like that? Uh, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea Submarine Voyage. What is this? That is so horrifying! Oh my gosh, look at the face and the tongue. That thing has been through it, you know? He's been there, done that. Oh my gosh, his head is gone. <laughs> 
<laughs> His head is gone. Where did it go? That was spooky. Underwater animatronics. You gotta do the point. <laughs> is that the same one? That one looks so derpy. Where is that? Oh my gosh, I don't like it. I don't like it. Maybe I do have a little bit of submechanophobia because like that one gives it to me. That's a shark, right? Orange shark. It's kind of cool. Never mind. It's not cool no more. Ew! It looks so like rusted and old right there. All right, this one is unsettling. Um, show me more. Well, their first one was. It's the same one. Okay, that one is creepy. That's creepy. Is that a real shark? No, it's a fake one. That looks so realistic though. Oh, is this Jurassic World? That has to be the Jurassic World ride. That's one of my favorite rides. I love that ride. That dragon. That is spooky. Okay, that one wouldn't want to be there alone at night. <laughs> that one's really creepy. Point. Abandoned animatronics. Burn the bunyip! I saw this in the last video. Ah! Okay, this one I think might be the most cursed underwater animatronic. Let me know in the comments down below, guys. Do you guys agree? Bert the Bunyip, I think he's winning right now. Oh my gosh, he's so cursed. I don't like Bert. Disney Sea Serpent. Is that a Disney one? That one we were just talking about? That is a Disney one. No way. I wonder which Disney ride that is because I've never been on it before and I don't know if I want to go on it after seeing that. Horrifying underwater animatronic. Wait, they didn't point. Moby the Whale. I think I've seen this one. Yeah, I talked about this in the last video. It looks so realistic. I actually thought that was a real whale the first time I saw that. Oh, and this one, Corsair the Sea Monster. Of course, sorry. I don't know how to say that. He's vomiting the water. <laughs> ah, look at his mouth and his teeth, okay? Yeah, that thing is creepy. It's cursed. This is curious. He's pointing again. The shark. I love how it's just called the shark instead of Jaws. Which ride is this? I wonder what it's from. Oh, look at those teeth. He's like vomiting water. Kaimbo Sunda Light. I can't say that word, but that looks like some kind of prehistoric fish of some sort. It's kind of scary, honestly. Oh, okay. I don't like that one. That one is spooky. That one is creepy, creepy. <laughs> it's this guy again. Oh my gosh. I just love these. I love that there's a whole series for this. The Haunting of Bly Manor. What is that? Is that for like a Netflix premiere? That is so creepy. It looks real. Hippopotamus. Is it the same one from Jungle Cruise? I think it is. Oh, okay. Actually, though, it is a little unsettling because it's so realistic and the way it just like bops there It's kind of freaky in a weird way that I can't explain the way it's like submerges down back into the water, too Is a little unsettling Abandoned underwater animatronics. Ooh, okay. Oh, I remember this one. That one's spooky. Okay Oh, that literally looks like a real like underwater dinosaur. All right I would be convinced it was real if I saw that in the wilderness. Oh, I hate that one so much. It's that whale again. That one is making its way around town for top scary Disney ones. The scariest underwater animatronics. Mildred the Cracklebog. He looks like a hedgehog sort of alligator. <laughs> I don't like how he swims. I really, really don't. If that was following me, I'd be so scared. Gardaland. That's where this one's at, guys. Gardaland. I don't like his facial expression. It's so angry looking. Why does it look like that and move like that? Ooh, I don't like it. Abandoned underwater animatronics then versus now. This sea serpent. Wait, do the eyes actually move like that? I didn't see that in the previous clips. It looks so derpy. I hate it. Oh my gosh, the now is horrifying. Yeah, that one is creepy. They must have got rid of that ride. <laughs> Bert the Bunyip is actually cursed now. What the actual heck? There's no way. He's so creepy. That is horrifying. Okay, Bert the Bunyip might be the scariest, y'all. Okay, guys. So this one, is this the same Disney one again? It has to be. No way. No way. Why does it move like that? Why does it have a beaver tooth in the front? That is, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Don't like it. Don't like it. Don't want to be locked in a room with this thing, especially underwater. Oh my gosh, this sea serpent is everywhere. I just hate the eyes on it so much, okay? Like, everyone keeps bringing this one up. I think it could be one of the most creepiest ones. And the fact that it came from Disney, like, why does it look like that? I hate it so much. They're actually so spooky. So guys, that's gonna be it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to smash a like and hit the subscribe button to join the family today. And also guys, comment down below what do you guys think was the scariest underwater animatronic in today's video? Honestly guys, there was a lot of scary ones, but that Disney one, it kind of freaked me out. And 
also guys, if you guys have not followed my social medias, I'll have them linked down below. Check out my Instagram. Be sure to follow my Instagram, guys. I've been posting a lot on there behind the scenes and all sorts of stuff. And I always engage with you guys on there. So be sure to check it out. It's linked down below. Also my Twitter and all my other socials like my TikTok. And also guys, here's today's daily shout out winners. Thank you guys so much for commenting on my videos. And if you guys want to win a shout out in the next video, just leave a nice comment down below for a chance to win a shout out in the next video. Anyways, guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.